New tonight, in Hampton Roads, there's a rise in the number of elderly people facing food insecurity. The nonprofit Meals on Wheels delivers meals to them every single day, but they have found recently that need has tripled. As Dana Smith found out, there's a big effort underway to make this make sure this vulnerable population is getting help and won't go hungry. The coronavirus pandemic is hitting senior citizens especially hard. We do Meals on Wheels deliveries, and since the start of COVID, our provision of meals has tripled. Debbie Schwartz of Senior Services of Southeastern Virginia said the number of people who rely on food deliveries from their Meals on Wheels program has grown dramatically since March. At least since COVID began, um, we have been providing 3,000 meals per week. And normally it's a thousand meals per week. For some Hampton Roads residents, it's the only hot food they're getting throughout the day. I spoke to a lady a couple of weeks ago who said to me, without the two meals you bring me every day, I wouldn't have anything else to eat. And it's because not only is she elderly, she is disabled and can't get out of the house. Schwartz said the pandemic is also affecting a lot of other work her volunteers do, like home visits. Under normal circumstances, volunteers would stop by the homes of elderly residents and sit and chat. Do what friends would normally do for friends, but during COVID, these people are getting phone calls. As the coronavirus pandemic wears on, Schwartz said senior citizens are especially vulnerable to isolation. These phone calls, in addition to the dinner drop-offs, help fight loneliness and help volunteers identify any issues. Like the lady I spoke about, um, if I hadn't spoken to her personally, we may not have known. For more information on how to volunteer or if you need meal deliveries, visit 13newsnow.com. Dana Smith, 13 News Now.